back again. Been away for a bit. The hot weather. It's giving me a bit of hay fever. So sorry if I sneeze. Um, today it's gonna like the title says it's gonna be a, what's coming on my channel. A bit of crafting, a bit of IKEA or what they call it. And car boot sat there because I live in Birmingham. Sat there we're gonna have um, car boot Hogs Lane. Because where I live, they have one in, I always get it mixed up, Selly Oak, Northfield. And then when Branston Cross open, I'm going to do a video on that and make all. I'll check with the chap and then if I can, I'll film what bargains I get and you can see what kind of car boot it's like. Right, um, a few bits I want to show you. As you can see, I've got a grey lipstick. I got this one off eBay. I can... I don't know if you can see it was only I think it was 250 because I get most of them so I thought I'd try it out it don't look too bad it looks a bit it's what they call it it's like matte lipstick so it shouldn't come off when you drink or anything and that's the um I don't know if you can see because when it shows sorry for my nails because I supposed to put some polish but I didn't and that's the um I don't know because when I see it it's back to front so I don't know if you can see uh, I think you might see it there. That's quite good. It's it's like they call um lip gloss. So that's the colour it comes. I thought I'd try a different dark colour. So. Looks alright. And then the little nail varnish that I'm the one that's peeling off. Is that one? That's from eBay 250. So I just thought I'd show you that what I've got. I always buy it off eBay. And on the eyeshadow is this one. I got a fave one for three quid. If you can see that one. Let's see, when I see it on the camera, it looks back to front, so I don't know if you can see. To me, it looks upside down or back to front. Right. When you get old, it's. <laughs> it's. <laughs> I had a bottle of wine yesterday, and I got up today and I was tired. I only had two glass, because it was one of them liquor bottles. I got up today I was tired so that's why I look a bit so what I'm gonna show you is stuff I'm doing crafting I've put a link down below of the girl that I'm subscribed to and she does quite good stuff upcycling and stuff like that but uh, better show you this first before the cat knocks it down pick this up somebody chuck it out no, was... you have arrived come right in until he finished and it was like polystyrene it's in the bin area because I always look in um bin and see if anything I can use for crafting and what I'm gonna do with this is spray it and I don't know if you can see I'm gonna put I'm gonna get a glue gun and I'm gonna put that like that and put like um cards you know like like cards or business stuff and then here I'm just gonna put like strips of magnets and stick stuff and then I don't know what color to spray it and then I'm gonna stick it on my craft room like that and then I can just put stuff stuff on there save me buying well I'm gonna get a pegboard from Ikea but it saved me getting any more any more things to stick on so I thought that'd be good and what I'm gonna do Halloween I'm gonna do a giveaway and I'm gonna get some because I'm gonna do like I said do Halloween uh, Ikea haul and what I'm gonna do is make some shadow boxes and I'm gonna do that Halloween do a giveaway I'll have to learn how to do that generator where they can pick your names out. Now this is an old biscuit tin. Somebody gave me for Christmas. I kept the biscuit tin. What I'm going to do with it is I might spray it with that chalk paint and then spray it and decorate it with ribbons and stuff and put stuff in it. Because I'm, I'm hoping to do a craft fair and put stuff in there like sweets or biscuits or something but decorate it with a ribbon and look a reindeer. I'm just but the reason I'm showing you these when it's finished I'm gonna show you take pictures and show you the before and after and then you can see see what they look like and these my partner been collecting all these tablets and that and these boxes I'm gonna decorate them put like a little um because I'm a tablet box and put like a little because I've got some foam put it in and put like little gifts you know like Christmas you can put gifts and give to people or sell at the craft fair and this one I'll have had done me I'm gonna do the same with it and put stuff in it 
and stick like pens or flowers or jars and this one like i'm gonna leave the link for that lady because i'm gonna do you know christmas when you get sweets <laughs> people give you sweets chocolate and then um, what's in there and chocolates so what i'm gonna do is spray this gold i think you have to do it like a sealer spray gold spray that gold my friend is 70 um june july august september and i'm gonna put 70 on there like good evening stuff. the master's like, been um, expecting you and stuff put there and then put like a little gif in there with some paper and that and that would look nice and when i do that i'll show you that as well and I'm hoping to get one of them wood burners and I want to do these. These are found, I think it was in a car boot, I found them. And I'm going to put, I don't know what to do with this, I might stick a skull in there. And then, and then you could just put it on the wall, like a skull, and put like um, patterns around it, decorate it. In the box, I'm just going to write something on there, wood burn it and... Put some of them there and see see what how it goes. Now I've finished finished my sitting room. Put the um, TV unit up yesterday. I got it off IKEA. I had to save up and got it. So sitting room hopefully finished. Just need to be painted and a bit of stuff in there like um, little ornaments like pictures and stuff like that. Because above the bottle I want to get a a pentagram. The cuckoo clock. The batteries run out, so it still works, but it doesn't. I put the battery in March, and it's run out again, so it doesn't. The light doesn't come up. So that's. Uh, so yes, yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do with upcoming videos, and there was some I wanted to say. I can't remember. I'll have a drink. <laughs> I might remember. <laughs> I'll have a drink. So. Oh, I still lost it. But yeah. So. Oh yeah. Let me see this. Right, I'm hoping to start crafting in August because my craft room I've got a table and it's got a load of stuff there and I've got a load of stuff under the table I want to do stuff with. I've got a lot of projects to do. And what I'm gonna do IKEA, I'm gonna get some blue bags and put the stuff in that I'm gonna do. And I want to get a table, I want to get a computer desk to put in so I can work on, and a chair. Once I've got the chair and a computer desk or a chair, I can start doing my crafting and then I'll show you stuff I'll be doing. And like I said, I'll be doing a giveaway for Halloween. I don't know what kind of picture I do. I might do Nightmare Before Christmas one or Game of Thrones one, I've got to think. Or I might do a vampire one. Because in Ikea, when I get them, I'll show it you. It's a, we call them box frames, and you can put pictures in and make it. You can get black and white ones. And Ikea, they're not quite expensive. I'm hoping to go to Ikea in June. So now it'll be May, because I've got a big bill to pay next month. So I'll be going in June, get some stuff, and I'll show you. Because we can't film in Ikea, so when I get there, I'll just show you. So I've got that coming up June. July hopefully I'll get my desk and everything and then there'll be more car boots and that brings us into August then I can show you what I'll be doing then August and September then October then November it'll be the cosplay again because I'll be ordering me me and um, costumes and I'll show you show you what they look like like I said I'm going as the queen from Game of Thrones a dragon and I'm going as Beetlejuice so that'd be good hopefully the wigs will come Right, I just want to say thanks to the new subscribers. I've got a few more subscribers, so that's great. Thank you for that. And I'm just doing this as a hobby, and I've seen I'm getting people watching my videos, which is brilliant. And, yep, that's what's going to come up, my video. So hopefully Saturday, I'll be doing a car boot one. Well, I'll be filming it, but it might upload on Sunday or Monday. 
because it's a big car boot but it's going to be the first one so i don't know what it's going to be like so i can um show you what it's like and then branston crosses my because you've got the cows and it's a big field and maypole is good because i've got the sheep there and i'll film that and that's it i think yep the um branston cross but there's not there's no other one we used to have one here but that's that's that used to be the big market i don't know if you remember the wholesale market and they closed it because they're building flats well they're building apartments and houses i think they said apartments and houses the big primarks because i i'm people say i'm lucky because i live quite near to town and i never go i just maybe once a week i go into town and I live so near, I don't have to catch a bus, nothing. I can just walk to town. So I just come out of here and walk straight down. I pass the old two. Sometimes I pass there with the dog and I can see all the vans and people standing there waiting to see the concert. Because I think um, Sting and Shaggy is going to be singing there soon. And I go past there and sometimes you can see them coming out with the security and everything. And I just carry on walking. I go to past TK Maxx. And then it's the big New Street Station. But what I do, I go through TK Maxx, through Debenhams, walk through, come out by the Apple shop, the big one, they got used to be the bookstore. Walk down past the Odeon, and there's the big new Primark. So I was going to film in there when I went last week, Wednesday, I think I went Wednesday. I think it was, yeah, Wednesday. But it was packed. So if any of you are thinking of going, go early, because it was packed. The chap said it will be packed because it's new. But it's brilliant. They've got Disney. But a shop where you can um, have tea, coffee. I don't know if that was a shoe, shoesy, you know, the shoesy things that people have fish and a lot of stuff there. I've got some leggings, but there's a lot of Harry Potter stuff, Game of Thrones stuff, and all kinds. So if you ever pop into Birmingham, have a have a look. It's quite good. Hoping that me and Lily Divine Light when she gets back from Glastonbury we might meet up there and have a walk and have a coffee together so anybody who wants to have a look then I'm near Birmingham so if I'm near town I can pop in and we could meet up so yep so that's it now so I haven't sniffed it's getting a bit cooler so so when you don't see me you know why it is it's me a fever so I thought I'd show you that bit Oh yes, I didn't show you the popcorn. I don't know. Did I show you the popcorn tub? Yes, I eat because I watch Netflix. Because I got Netflix. Because when I subscribe to O2, they give you six months free Netflix, and I've been watching. And then I go to Iceland and get big tubs of popcorn. I've got four of them. And like this tub would last me two days. I eat half, so I would eat that much. Then the next day, that much. So but when I'm watching American Horror. And this I'm gonna craft with as well, I'll show you. I don't know what to do with this one. I might I might um use it for storage to do a lot of things. Because this don't come off. So what I'm gonna do is get one of them there's a name for it, it's like a white thing you can just spray it on and it's supposed to prime it and then you put paint on it. So I might do something with it, a flower pot or something. So of storage when I do craft fair. Because I'm hopefully when I do my craft fair I'm gonna do a video of that and you can see what it's like because some shops you gotta ask permission because i went into where was it in town it's a big store in town it was um was it tiger i think tiger where i walk i think it's tiger or there's another one i'm sure it's tiger and the lady was filming there and the girl come and said so oh, glad you filming. could make it and she had to um stop filming so some of them let you film, some don't. Because the lady said to me that they only... <laughs> oh, no. oh. The lady said to me they only let people film if it's a learning stuff, if people want to learn for the schools. So that's why, so hopefully. Hopefully I can get some videos out and filming over the summer and stuff like that. I want to do a graveyard one as well, so that would be good. So, yeah, I think that's it now for this video, and I can see.
see my eyebrows as you get older yeah it's good but i used to have a lot of um eyebrows when i was younger but now it's going well i am 53 next week so in it <laughs> right then so i see you folks hopefully saturday i'm picking up some stuff on spot thursday so i might do show you that with the cardboard stuff it was um a candle sit with a load of skulls in there a four quid and where you can put your cake a cake dish with a skull on top and the skull legs and i saw that in tk max that was for nine pounds but the lady selling it for five and that's got four so the two items are going to be nine pounds so hopefully pick it up thursday saturday the carbons and then that will be all together so yeah so it's monday so what rest of what left of easter <laughs> have a nice time I had some chocolates, didn't get no egg, so I had chocolate, so. Right, I might be watching some telly or, I don't know, I might just relax or go to sleep, tired. Yes, it was only that much, but I was drinking, so. And I think that's it. I can't think of anything else to tell you guys, but. I think that's it. Oh, I've been challenged to eat some sweets. I can't find them as soon as I find them I'll do that video it's um I can't remember what the sweets was called but I'll put it on at the end of this video I think it was bean but I, I can't remember and I'm looking for them sweets I'm gonna do the challenge so if you're watching Lily I am gonna do the challenge just I can't find the sweets so I'll, I'll do that so no, I went Tesco they didn't have any I went Morrison's because where I live, there's a Morrison's up by five ways. And it used to be a Tesco, but they're not, well, they moved the Tesco down to Dudley Road, where the hospital is. And we got a Morrison's, where the children's hospital used to be. The back of there, and there's a Tesco, and they didn't have it. Morrison's didn't have it, Tesco didn't have it. Sainsbury hasn't got it. So when I pop into town, I might have a look at B&M or Home Values. I might go to one stop. Good evening. Good evening. Wonderful to see you here this evening. Yeah, so hopefully I'll catch you on the next one. And like I said, hopefully August I'll be start doing crafting. Just me craft rooms in a right mess. I've got stuff all over the place. So I need to get some stuff where I can work on. I need a chair, like I said, and the table. So hopefully I can get that in July. Because June, I'm gonna go IKEA and get a few stuff, and then July, gotta get because I might have to get the IKEA. Thank you for finish. joining us this evening. So that's I it, folks. I may be of some service. Um, yep, I can't think of anything else. I think I've been talking enough now, so and I'll catch you on the next one. Hopefully, the car boot. You can see what stuff I pick up at the car boot. I'm looking for a tripod, so hopefully, I can get one so I can put the iPad because it's on the coffee table. Maybe that's what I'm looking down and i might get a little one for the phone as well so i can do a roaming so that'd be good right for folks you have a nice easter what's left of it enjoy and i'll catch you on the next one Cheers. <laughs>